Hello, my friend, and welcome to Wisdom Trek. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, your guide to wisdom and creating a living legacy. Thank you for joining us for our five-day-per-week wisdom and legacy-building podcast. This is day 732 of our trek, and time for a three-minute mini-trek called Wisdom Unplugged. This short nugget of wisdom includes an inspirational quote with a little bit of additional content for today's trek. Consider this your vitamin supplement of wisdom for today. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. Today's quote is from William Penn, and it is, I expect to pass through this world but once. Any good thing, therefore, I can do, or any kindness I can show to any fellow creature, let me do it now. Let me not defer or neglect it, for I shall not pass this way again. Any kindness that I can show. Kindness is not an inconvenience to be avoided, but a characteristic to be embraced. Sometimes it is as simple as a pleasant smile, a warm handshake, sending a thank you note, assisting a neighbor with a household project, or being with a friend in distress. I have heard it said, the greatest thing a man can do for his heavenly father is to be kind to his other children. Kindness originates in the heart of God. God is kind because he cannot be otherwise. It is essential to his nature. Likewise, that kindness becomes part of our new nature, which comes to us through the Holy Spirit. Kindness becomes a part of our conduct because our character is rooted in God. Kindness provides for other people's needs. Kindness is more than a pat on the back saying, have a nice day. Kindness gets involved. It gets its hands dirty. It is visible and active. It moves beyond the spiritual and the emotional to the physical and the practical. The watchword for today's society is don't get involved. But at the heart of a kind person is involvement. They see the needs of others and seek to fill them. They are willing to risk in order to help others out. They know that they can't do everything, but they can do something. 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 15 says, See that no one pays back evil for evil, but always try to do good to each other and to all people. That's a wrap for today's Wisdom Unplugged. If you enjoy these quotes, I have created and published a searchable database of over 10,000 quotes that I have collected for many years. If you'd like free access to my database of inspirational quotes, the link is available on the main page of wisdom trackcom And just as you enjoy these nuggets of wisdom, please encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek creating a legacy if you'd like to listen to any of the past 731 daily treks or read the wisdom journals they are available at wisdom-track.com and thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide your mentor but most importantly i am your friend as i serve you through the wisdom trek podcasting journal each day and as we take this trek of life together let us always live abundantly love unconditionally listen intentionally learn continuously lend to others generously lead with integrity and then leave a living legacy each day i am guthrie chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward enjoy your journey and then create a great day every day see you tomorrow for philosophy friday